Hey guys, welcome back again. So I have just arrived Thailand, Bangkok, and the time check is 15 minutes to 8. It's a bit cold. I am wearing a jumper. I feel it's just the airport anyways because the weather is quite warm outside. But yeah, it was like an hour 45 minutes from Singapore to Thailand and I slept most of the time. Uh, I'm a bit tired but we'll see. Welcome to Thailand. Let's have some fun. First city is Bangkok. Okay, I hope the vlogs can finally start. Yo, I've been working for legit <laughs> It's so far like to the baggage claim. It's very far from where we're coming from. I've been working for like 10 minutes. Bangkok is this how you feel. Airport is so big and I've not even seen any clue that we are reaching the baggage claim area. Anyways, what do I know? Immediately I got to the immigration area, I was asked to turn back so I can get a yellow fever card and before coming i read about this but i didn't know it was this serious and going for the fact that i am not coming from nigeria i didn't expect to be sent back because i'm actually coming from australia i was coming from australia and last i checked australia is not a yellow fever endemic country so why i was sent back i cannot really place my mind on but it was a bit embarrassing because i already stood in the queue for a long time immediately it was my turn to get checked in i was asked to provide a yellow fever clearance and i told them i have a yellow fever card because i have my yellow fever vaccine and i had the card with me i always travel with the card anyway my yellow fever card and i showed it to them but they were like no i need clearance from your medical personnel so i was sent back because of my nigerian passport okay so yeah <laughs> Thank you. But why was I asked to come back? All passengers what? So not where you're coming from, but your passport. So everybody has to get this. Thank you. So guys, so I've just been asked to get health declaration because of yellow fever. <laughs> Blah, blah, blah. But anyway, I just got it and it's free. So if you're coming to Thailand and you have, have an African passport, you would need that. So it's just a leaflet and you get it on the left side when you are coming in. Okay. So this is their same card plan for tourists. So if you come here, you can easily get it from the airport or you can buy it when you come into Thailand. I did buy mine when I got into Thailand, but it's up to you if you want to get I don't think there's much of a difference to be honest. This is Grab. I told you in my Singapore vlog, if you're coming to Asia, you need to download Grab because this app is going to be very essential to you for transportation, feeding and all that. Not a great way to start Thailand. Why is the car not moving? Hey, Chineke got it. And this is almost past 9 o'clock. We have to get another car to do it. Let's hope for the best now. After the car issue it started and we left, honestly, I wasn't feeling too well anymore with the whole issue I've encountered since I arrived. But anyways, let's have a room tour. I will. Yes. Thank, Thank you. you very much. All right. Bye. Bye. So yeah, let's do a quick room tour. This is Amara Resort here in Bangkok. It's like 40 minutes ride from the airport to this resort. So here you come in, big mirror, and some wardrobes. Here is the wash area toilet i don't know why look the toilet has these things which is actually the first time i'm seeing this but i like the fact that they've got a bidet that bidet you don't really find it much in europe and i've actually not seen it in australia or oh, it's an asian thing and i love that i've 
most places i've been to in asia they always have that in their toilet which i like and a call i don't know do they expect me to and call them <laughs> i had this in montenegro as well so yeah it makes me laugh so here yeah, very big anyways one thing about asian hospitality their resorts they always give you toothbrush and toothpaste which is something i didn't get much when i was in europe so i love that and yeah amara so this is the resort i'm currently staying in so if you want to come here please come they are very nice staffs are lovely so yeah shower room with all the essentials okay and you can just open this and see Okay, nice. We've got drinks in the fridge, just water. I need another mirror. I'm just coming, so my things are just a bit everywhere. Nice king side bed and a TV, reading area, and this big mirror. and we have the outside it's dark right now so you can't see but during the day i'm gonna show you how it looks like okay so yeah this is my first impression about thailand bangkok instead of roughly but it's not too bad anyways um day one i've just checked in and tomorrow i'm gonna get along with my group because you all know that this is a group trip right so today is just me checking i did come in earlier than the rest of the group because i just wanted to um come in and make sure everything is okay before they come but yeah this is it um thank you so much for watching and i hope you do enjoy the rest of the vlog and also sit pull for my next vlogs because i'm gonna be doing more vlogs on thailand and everything we go up to and i hope you love it thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys later bye 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 <laughs> how can i go without telling you guys the views in bangkok they are amazing look so this is the view from the rooftop bar in our hotel amara and yes this is not where we stayed for the whole of our stay in bangkok we actually checked into another hotel which i will be showing you in my next video so make sure you are subscribed because that's where all the fun actually is okay so thank you so much for watching now this is the final goodbye okay i know i said goodbye before but yeah thank you thank you <laughs>